This is the night. I will remove the spell and free myself from the sphere, no matter the cost! Well, hello everybody! My name is Pazu, welcome to Witch's Legacy, covered by the knights. Yeah, I know I have a lot to say about the previous Witch's Legacy games, the newer ones, but uh, I am going to uh, try this new one. Yeah, we well, try this out, see if I like it or not. Anyway, here we go, let's try out this new demo now. Let's play everybody. cosmic event, a supermoon that coincides with a lunar eclipse. During the eclipse, the moon will pass closer to Earth than usual. It will also take on a reddish color, which is completely normal. Jack, there's been a terrible attack on campus. I managed to hide, but... <laughs> Annabelle? I have to get to campus. Fast. This is the University of Witchcraft's dorm. Jack, I'm over here. Whoa, evil pumpkins! <laughs> Annabelle's in danger. I have to get rid of the pumpkins. Yeah. Hey, Savage Life. Hello, welcome. And Cece, hello. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Little way to put these flames out. Oh. And who is this guy? He's breathing. He must be under some kind of spell. I can't lift it myself. What is wrong with him? Chapter 3 Managing Weather Magical rain stakes are used to create rain during periods of prolonged drought or to extinguish the fires. Maybe I can use this spell to put out the flames? Put out the pumpkins! Annabelle said the ritual drums are called Jimbe. Dijim. Dijim. Dijimbe. <laughs> okay, Shaman Mask can activate them. There's absolutely something wrong with that guy. <laughs> Is he possessed? He looks possessed. And the red moon. That's not a good omen. Celebrate International Week. Sample a truly unique tea from our samovar. Our samovar? Samovar. What's samovar? It is samovar. He the poor tea. What is samovar? A teapot, I suppose. <laughs> is it a teapot? A fancy name for a teapot. Magic lamp. Alright, so they still have the puzzle pieces as bonus items, so that's good to know. Alright, we cannot go that way. Oh, we can. University of Witchcraft Laboratory. The key for the for the key for this must be shaped like a flask. Alright, what is wrong with the ring stake? Using clouds? We can call the rain. It looks like one side is missing the bell. Ah. Calling the rain! Calling the rain clouds. Can I use it now? Wow, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> Alright. The pumpkins are gone. Heading into the dorm hall. Jack! Please! Stop him! Another soul for me? No. You have no magic. You're useless. Ah, 
Oh, okay, so it's Jack and Annabelle. I'm not too familiar with this new characters. The last few games, I only played the demo. I didn't play the complete games. Yeah, I guess I'm still stuck with the old characters. Lynn, the aunt, and of course, Imp. <laughs> I miss those characters, really. Someone broke off the emblem. Two birds, two crows. University of Witchcraft, War of Honor. The best students of magic attend this institution at once. They had to hide their abilities, but he but we helped pave the way for their future. Ah, so they can go in public now. <laughs> they can use their spells publicly. Toy gun. The plant needs some water. What are we planting, by the way? I've got to find all the ingredients so I can put the monster to sleep. Magic Valerian blooms when planted in the new pod. Its pollen can calm aggressive creatures. Ah, okay, so we need that, uh, the lights. That's how it grows. Artificial lighting. <laughs> Pollen. So we just sprinkle this onto the plant. Sprinkle! Need to focus! <laughs> uh, put it inside again. The pistol can use round objects and as ammunition. Maybe putting the pollen into a, a shell, a gun shell. That could work. Alright, hold on Annabelle, I'll save you. A map. Hello, Halloween Annabelle. Happy Halloween. We know how much you like chocolate. Put this on the magic silver tray for a surprise. Your classmates. Magic silver tray. <laughs> they all disappear, I suppose. <laughs> These are fake. An illusion. Pumpkins. Oh, they are all different. The smiley face. Sad face. Uh, okay, that is... Maybe this one's the happy face. <laughs> this one's grinning. I think someone's living in the house. The bells could wake them up. Macarons. I don't like macarons, guys. Do you like macarons? <laughs> I found them too sweet. They are way too sweet. I just don't like them at all. Uh, a candy worm, a candy bag. <laughs> Caramel apple. I don't like that too. <laughs> I don't like it. Ooh. Again, way too sweet. Don't let that coating at all. Yeah, I'm not that much into sweets. Are those gumballs? Uh, Kendo, rabbit. Crescent Moon. Gingerbread Man. You know what? I haven't opened up this one yet. Hold on. <laughs> A surprise face. Orange. A mask. Shoe? Chocolate shoe. I need to find a bell. A doorbell. Hmm. 
Oh, there we go. Package of candy. They're like gumballs. Like dozens of gumballs. Now, they could be the pallets. Seriously. <laughs> Can we put some sipping powder into the balls? Just, yeah, sprinkle them. Sprinkle them on. <laughs> Load that gun, my weapon of choice. <laughs> BB gun. Oh. This integrator. Wow, that is a strong weapon. And a bell's room. He's taking her soul, her spirit. Oh no, she's breathing though, which means she's alive. I've got to find out more about this sorcerer. Wow, those black veins on the face, just like the other guy outside the house. So his soul got taken too, just like Annabelle. Bertha and Annabelle are very close. Bertha is a skunk? Oh, maybe not a skunk. Um, I don't know, it, it is a very small animal, <laughs> a companion in the, in the previous games. Soon the blood will be rise, after getting out of this prison, I will finally be able to put my plan into action. Sorcerer's Sphere, it's like a crystal ball. Hey, who are you? <laughs> That's Foxy, Annabelle's pet fox. He's being aggressive because he's scared. Uh, is that my companion? No, it doesn't look like that, no. Oh, it's a ferret. Yeah, that's right, it's a ferret. <laughs> not a skunk, and <laughs> not this fox. The companion is a ferret. Annabelle, are you okay? When you didn't call me back, I thought... Bertha, it's Jack. Annabelle and the other students were attacked and charmed by a sorcerer. Oh no. Hold on, I'll be right there. Okay, our pet companion is coming. <laughs> the ferret is coming. Helen, you can see my work on the analysis of magical artifacts in the folder. The pre... the... The password is on my computer desktop, Annabelle. 8630. Wow, what the heck is this? An arcade game. <laughs> Lead Jack through the maze while overcoming obstacles and collecting scrolls. Select highlighted items to put them into the inventory. And select inventory items to use them in obstacles. Jack used to be a regular guy who didn't believe in magic. Use a ladder. Hey, this is pretty cool. <laughs> but when he came face to face with a dark witch, Jack learned that the magic is not only real, but can be harmful. I'll uh, use a torch. <laughs> Smoke him out. Okay, that's the ferret. Uh, can we go down? A witch named Bertha, who could turn into a ferret, came to Jack's aid. Thanks to her, Jack learned that there were also good witches. Definitely. Okay. Now use my 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 magic spell, my wand. 
Jack also had a good wish named Annabelle. They fell in love with each other. Break the walls. Uh, jumping boots. <laughs> oh, the ferret. Ah. Jumping boots. Climbing boots. The flying boots. They're even better. <laughs> yeah, that's even better, guys. Even though Jack had no magical powers, his bravery helped defeat evil many times. Uh, use my sword? <laughs> and Jack and Annabelle, uh, they fell in love. 